Hi, I'm Vance, and welcome to Repair and Replace. If you find water underneath your water heater, it doesn't always mean that the tank needs to be replaced. It might just be a simple fix. In this episode, I'll show you where to look to narrow down the leak. The temperature and pressure relief valve is one of the most important safety devices in your water heater. If the tank heats up and the pressure gets too high, the valve will open and release water, preventing the tank from exploding. After the valve discharges, it should close all the way. There shouldn't be any water dripping out. First, check the drain tube. If you can feel any water dripping, then it's possible that the spring is corroded and the valve is not closing properly. Additionally, check to see if there's any water leaking around the threads. If there is a slow continuous leak, then it's best to replace the relief valve. You can see how to do this in the video linked in the description. Now if the relief valve opens intermittently or even daily, then it's most likely due to normal water pressure expansion. This can be fixed by installing a diaphragm type expansion tank on the cold water supply line. In these cases, it's best to contact a technician. The drain valve is used during regular maintenance to drain and flush the tank. This valve is often made out of plastic, which can crack over time. It's recommended to install a brass drain valve as these are the most reliable. First, Check to see if there's any water inside the outlet. Now, check around the valve to see if there's any water coming out of the threads. If you see any water, then replace the drain valve. And you can see how to do this in the video link below. Water can also leak out of the cold supply inlet and the hot water outlet pipes. First, check the threaded connections into the tank. Now, check each connection between the pipes. If there's any water, then it should be fixed. This is often best handled by a technician. If you didn't find water coming out of any other connection, then it could be the inner tank. Remove the door cover. If the insulation is wet, then it's possible that the inner tank has rusted out. At this point, it might be best to get a new tank installed. Hopefully this has helped you narrow down the leak in your water heater. If you like this and want to see more tutorials and informational videos, then subscribe to our channel. And if you need help, you can call or visit our neighbor location to talk with our knowledgeable staff. Thanks for watching.